Hello and welcome to yet another video here on the YouTube channel Spiel for Ending in the Fellowship SDF. My name is Andreas Norwegian Viking and this is my hobby vlog. So, um, I managed to get a hobby vlog at, out uh, last Monday and uh, that was my um, fast track to, uh, to SteamCon, I guess. And um, I didn't get to finish everything. I still, so there we are, four, four hunters left on the counter there, uh, I didn't finish, but uh, I managed to get my hands on farmers, well, both farmers box number two and uh, blacksmith box number two for Gilball. So this week um, I will be painting, um, I will be finishing the uh, Lake Town Guard I have sitting at home. Just a few bits and bobs left, and uh, I will try. I will try to paint all twelve blacksmiths in four days. <laughs> so, uh, so yeah, I have them sitting here. So I'll show you um, how far I've gotten so far. It's spoiler. It's not that far. So we'll see. All right. So here we are back, and uh, I have. A box, box full of blacksmiths, including two terrain pieces and two goals. And what I've found with these plastics is that I don't like the bases. <laughs> That's the first thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do like this. So I have removed the uh, model from the base. I will clean this up. I will attach... Uh, sand and uh, stones to the base and then I will make indentations for the horse or models for the other ones to stand on and then I will um, I will paint the model and the uh, the base separately uh, to get better uh, better covering so yeah uh, that's how far I've got now so I'm doing a bit of editing on uh, several videos now, so I'll um, I'll do both of the things at the same time. Edit a bit and then clean up some bit and uh, edit a bit more. All right, so I'll show you when I have something more for you guys. Hello everyone, I am back and uh, it's currently Friday. So um, for those of you who are following along, uh, I've been on and off like sick, like colds, flus. Just um, yeah, headaches, stuff like that for for weeks upon weeks, and it's happened again. Uh, so I don't know if it's post Steam Con flu or if it's something else, <coughs> but yeah, I have felt terrible. So the last few days, uh, I've been just lying in bed doing nothing, and um, and yeah, so um, I haven't really done. What I wanted to do with the blacksmiths, um, although, bar a few comments, um, I I did think I would at least get a six-man team going, um, maybe even ten, because the blacksmiths are pretty straightforward. Uh, loads of armor. Um, thing that takes the longest time with me is if I have to switch paints because uh, then I get easily distracted by other things and <coughs> basically <coughs> click on the internet for half an hour before I paint it another colour. So, um, so yeah, I um, haven't done what I wanted to do with these. So I, I realised that I couldn't finish them in time for the tournament on Sunday, which is a shame. So um, instead... I am concentrating on these three nice people. So we have Ulfur, Skatha and Veteran Hearn. And uh, I'm getting these done um, for the tournament. At least Skatha and Veteran Hearn. <coughs> Those two are my priority. So I've, I've done the most of Skatha so far. So Skatha is, um, is nearing completion. It's just some armor bits, some pieces of leather, and uh, and some headgear stuff, and she's pretty much done uh, for 
veteran hand. <coughs> I haven't, <coughs> sorry, I haven't started the leather or skulls sorry, anything else. So uh, that's something I will do today. And, uh, and yeah, we will we'll see how far I get. Uh, hopefully the cold doesn't take too much out of me uh, for this. So, um, so yeah, we'll see. We'll see what happens. All right, so I'll update you when I have some progress to show. All right, so we are back, and uh, it's been good five hours painting, um, and uh, on the Saturday. So the tournament is tomorrow, and uh, I have made some progress on these two lovelies. So it is, of course, Veteran Hearn and Scather. So um, what I'm planning to do is wake up early and do the bone detail on Veteran Hearn and just attach static grass to his base and do the metals and his his beard and eyes and that will essentially be him done um, so I can bring him to the tournament uh, for Scather she is done barring static, gr static grass on her base and I must say I'm pretty happy with this I am pretty pretty happy uh, I think she looks absolutely lovely it's a wonderful sculpt um, I think I managed to capture her like ethereal hair a bit so, uh, so yeah uh, tell me what to think in the comments below and I will update you tomorrow on uh, whether or not I get this big guy done for the tournament as well but for now I at least have one more player in Scather. So, uh, so yeah, see you guys tomorrow. Alright, so I am back and it's Sunday evening. So, uh, just had the tournament. I was at the studio very early this morning, about half past seven. And I did manage to finish these two lovely models. So, we have uh, Scather. She was finished uh, Saturday, though. So, um, very chuffed with her. But I also managed to, well, I say finish. Um, some of the metal needs a bit of work. But he's essentially finished. This is, of course, Veteran Hearn. So, quite pleased with this model as well. Uh, looks awesome. So, the the sculpt. Oh, I'm not bragging about my paint job. <laughs> so, um, yeah. This is my Hunter's Guild so far. So... This is 12 models with one union support. So I do have uh, Ulfa and Young Theron to finish before I uh, am satisfied with this guild being finished. But yeah, uh, I'm quite happy with how they are looking. Um, my first entirely painted guild ball team uh, when I finish uh, Ulfa and Veteran, uh, well, uh, Young Theron. So, uh, so it will be exciting. So yeah, you've seen. You've seen these before if you watch the channel. So um, I won the tournament. So we had um, first I played against morticians. Um, never had much um, luck playing morticians. I uh, usually play them with alchemists. I, I did win a couple of games, but never with my hunters, and um, that went well. Um, I, I took a couple of takeouts and a goal. <laughs> So enough to, to get me the win. Uh, it was against a slightly inexperienced player. Um, and he's never used uh, uh, blacksmith, no, uh, sorry, um, morticians before. So it was kind of a one-sided match. But it was an inter interesting one. And I think he learned a lot. So the second matchup was against uh, Engineers. So um, I, I, I st always struggle. Uh, playing against engineers, but again, I, I managed to get myself the win. Uh, very, very hard fought victory. Uh, it was good though. And then I played against uh, Christian, uh, who's turned out to be a very good girl ball player with his fisherman, uh, Shark. So he got in two very quick goals, uh, and, and I, I did take out some models. And then I just took out two models 
the final two models I needed because it was 10-8 and then he scored with Chuck and I didn't bother reclaiming ball because it would just be picked off the model carrying the ball. So I just went and killed. I, I blew Shark off with uh, Chaska, the guy with the um, with the shotgun. And then um, Theron killed... No, Theron. Uh, yeah, Theron killed uh, Grayscales. Uh, so yeah, that was a very, very good match. And for the final, it was against um, uh, Butchers. So uh, Snorra is also a very good girl ball player now. He, um, I've been playing against his uh, his um, masons quite a lot, but these guys are lovely. Um, you play them well. Uh, sadly, uh, the result didn't really, really make for that because it went fourteen two to me. Um, I, I basically uh, at this point I had won the tournament. Uh, I was the only guy with three victory points, and I was well up in the um, in the strength of schedule. So I would only need to have a good match off against him, uh, but I didn't need to win. <laughs> so uh, what then transpired was uh, I I was there to have fun essentially, and I had painted Skather. So uh, I basically made a random uh, person choose an arm. In one arm, I had Theron and. Uh, Fahad, and in the other I had uh, Skatha and Snow. So the the players had left, and I played the left hand, didn't see it before I revealed, and it was Skatha and Snow. So then I played with Veteran Hearn for the first time, Skatha Snow for the first time, Zarola, um, the proper Zarola, not the rookie one we played at SeamCon for the first time, and uh, Chaska and uh, Jaycar. And it, I scored twice with Skather missing the first goal but regaining it and shooting again and then I uh, took out two of his players I took out uh, Veteran Biscuit and Boar so very exciting matchup very very fun uh, cool to shoot some snowballs around and uh, do a lot of dodges <laughs> so this team can do it both and first time I played without Cena this lovely bear so yeah that's it, I think. I will end this video here and get it uploaded for Monday. Um, please comment, like, share, and subscribe. Uh, remember, we have our subscription competition running. You only have to find um, the video we posted on Friday, which is the 1,000 uh, subscriber competition. You only have to comment in that post to be eligible to win. And, uh, and yeah. Uh, consider supporting us on Patreon using the link in the description below. It is a way for you to support us doing what we love, but giving you more content. And as always, support your hobby.